hello guys welcome to my channel yes this is just me and thank you for stopping by if this is your first time seeing my face i love you and please make sure you subscribe so you'll be the first to know anytime i post a new video and if you have been here with me from day one to now i just want to say a very big thank you i live from the bottom of my heart you have been wonderful and i thank you for your support for your subscriptions your comments i just love you guys thank you you can't know how grateful i am yes i'm very very sorry i can't know how grateful i am but all the best i'm grateful i thank you because it's not easy and it's not that it's a big grace you know that i'm giving you anything but you just decide to show me love you just decide to do it to me just like to i just love you guys you guys have been wonderful to me and i i don't want, i don't even know what to say i'm speechless for now all i just want to say is i'm thank i'm thankful and grateful to you guys thank you so today today i want to talk about something what I want to talk about is very, very important. Like, I want to talk about when, when electricity goes off in your home, what do you miss first? Like most of us, the electricity condition in our country, let me say, yes, my country, is not always stable. And I don't know why. I'm a Nigerian. We had one problem. We had one supply in Ghana. Um, electricity, but they are having electricity that stable that is very stable. With that, we are the supplier. We do it's not always stable. You cannot in my, my own part. You cannot have a, a electricity stable for like twenty four hours. Why? Why? Is it that we are not eligible to use that kind of light, or it's just like it's a taboo if we, if we if we have electricity twenty four hours a day? I've not experienced it. We have living. It don't do they, they will try to take it off. They will take the light off. I don't know. And I hate it. There is this kind of joy you feel whenever you just see light, you just everybody shouts up in a bar. There's this kind of joy, especially when your phone is already down, like when your phone is down even if it's off. And you just there's light. Wow. There's this kind of joy. I know you you get it. This kind I don't know, there's inner peace. If I'm even I'm like pretty people that don't that have never they've never ever seen electricity. You know that there are some areas they did not have bulb. Not to, they did not even have transformer, not to talk of wire. There are some there are some areas eh, the transformer has been there, see. But see today they don't have electricity. It's a very painful issue. It's a very it's a very painful issue. Like very painful. I'm also thankful that we will still have light here. There is this kind of joy you feel. I'm very serious. There's this kind of joy you feel anytime there is light, it does bring light. I don't know, it just looks like as if you are and you're on your way to paradise. Like you get this now. So so once once they take the lights, you no know, electricity is very important and it's crucial to any economy that that wants to go. Yes. Because we have entrepreneurs that need stable electricity we have inventors we have investors that we want to leave their country and come to your country because we have stable electricity let's say chain industry that need electricity people that work in the water let's say water stops like that those water corporation they need stable electricity people that are name it there are different things that need stable electricity manufacturing industries they need electricity i don't know in this 21st century there is no industry that does not need electricity there's no economy that can just survive without electricity and we thank god now that there have been some new inventions we now have solar yes you can use sun charge the lights once there is sun you just carry it out the panel and put it you can put it on your on your roof you can put it on the floor somewhere where nobody is going to go there or any damage stuff like that and the sun will charge it so you can even after charging it even as it's it's, it's for usb you plug it then you charge your phone you then go this world is moving the world is now becoming a global world everything is already going digital so it's just that it's expensive people that are low low income earner people that when they collect salary is not even enough for them how will somebody be working for like a month before you get money that's why i always say be an entrepreneur be the boss of yourself nobody can sack anybody in this world as well people that are working manually eh they'll still be laid off 
because now robots can do the works of human robots machines are now doing are taking places of human beings yes so the world is going digital so i would like you to be an entrepreneur of yourself like don't depend on anybody work for yourself nobody can come and shout at, at you anyhow be the boss of yourself in this this world you are doing there is a man he's an entrepreneur he's into these recharge stuff all these data stuff like if he wants to teach you how you can get to learn the way he's doing it those digital stuff yeah, do you know the amount you are going to pay my god millions of dollars it's ending well it's still fine he's not working for anybody it's the boss of himself appointment with him if you decide you can cancel the appointment there's nothing you do it's the boss of himself that's what i'm saying this is what is going to get so this electricity is a very very common issue and a very important thing, an issue for us to talk about the government should please improve on how electricity can be stable all over the country there's some parts they've not they've not experienced this uh, electricity of for a, for a while now it's so painful and you want your country to grow to grow uniformly how will it work how will it work it's true electricity that we charge our phone before we can call someone that is not even here you can call stay here and call someone that is it uh, eight thousand kilometers away, and the person will still hear you. So look at yourself, you are seeing yourself. If you don't have electricity, how will your phone? How will it on? If you, I don't have electricity, how will I use my phone as I'm using it to send this thing to him? It's not possible. So there is a very common issue, and people, yes, people can relate to this. That's what I'm saying. That what do you first miss when electricity goes off in your house? Let me just tell you mine. What I miss when electricity goes off in my hand, I miss charging my phone. I'm used to it, and I know it's risky. Charging your phone while pressing it is a very, very risky thing to do. So I've been trying to stop these days. So what I'm trying to say is that what I miss is charging my phone. Once I take the light, even if my battery is 100%, I'm feeling like, wow, it's going down. Like electricity, let it be stable. Let it be stable. Please, government. Let them come and hear our cry. We need electricity, stable one. Some um, industries have crumbled because of lack of electricity. Yes, information has been like discarded just because of lack of electricity. Something can happen now. There is no stable electricity for me to charge my phone. For me to pass the information across to you, how? How will I do it? How? Is that, is that, are we talking about the fuel? If I don't have money to buy the fuel at that time, call. if I don't have money to even, even I, I don't have gen, generator. So what are we talking about? Yes. I'm not talking about anything. So, I need electricity is very What I miss most is charging my phone. Because I like my phone to be always 100%. I don't know why, I just like it. I just like it. So charging my phone, charging my phone, that's what I always miss. And I miss um, watching television. I like watching this more. Um, there's this movie I'm watching right now. It's titled Se Second Chance. If you know the movie I'm talking about, you can kindly comment in the comment box below for me to know. So this Second Chance, it is sometimes it's not always stable for me to watch it. I might miss is an episode today, tomorrow they will bring like next month they will not be like at that particular time. So I miss watching those series that is, I do watch. Yes, I do watch um imposter. Those are mess Mexican films. Yes, they're Mexican movies. So once they take the light, once the lights goes over, I don't know. There's a kind of feeling like darkness all over me. I just I like and this should just be. Um, like now there is electricity right now that i'm talking to you yes so once you take this light i don't know i'm going to feel one guy yes so you guys watching me if you are new and you are returning subscriber i would like you to comment in the comments box below what do you miss most once the light goes up in your home
yes what do you miss most once the light goes up in your home so thank you for staying by don't forget to subscribe subscribe so make sure you like the video subscribe and make sure you come back to check because i'm all here for you thank you guys for staying with me it's not it's not been easy but we thank god and i want to thank you guys out there for your love for everything i'm always grateful to you guys for new subscribers this morning i see our new subscribers if anyhow you want me to improve on my video you can kindly comment below so i'll try to adjust if the video is not good enough you can comment to tell me with if something or anything is just wrong with the video please you can comment in the comment box below so i love you guys i'll be seeing you guys next time